up guys it's finally december and that means the murder mystery 2 christmas update is going to be releasing this month and everyone is getting extremely hyped as we all know every single year murder mystery 2 celebrates christmas is an insanely huge update coming into the game we've been seeing this since like 2015 but not everyone has played a christmas update in murder mystery 2 before so that sparks the question of what we could exactly be expecting from this update so in this video i'm going to be talking about everything we should be expecting in this christmas update starting with the most obvious thing is a brand new christmas Christmas lobby. We always see a brand new Christmas lobby ever since the first Christmas update. And the Christmas lobbies are always extremely amazing. Last year's Christmas lobby specifically is one of my favorite lobbies in all time of Murder Mystery 2. Like definitely my top three favorite lobbies of all time. It does make me wonder on what the MM2 team is going to do for a lobby this year. And if they can even top last year's Christmas lobby since they went so crazy last year. Like but we're also going to be seeing all the old Christmas maps coming back into the game. Specifically the workshop, log cabin, train station and ice castle map all these are fan favorite maps in the murder mystery 2 community so it's going to be extremely exciting being able to play all these maps again in murder mystery 2 for a limited time we might also see a brand new christmas map we're not really too sure if we will though since we didn't see a brand new halloween map this year when we usually do see new map for halloween and christmas it's not 100 percent confirmed but what is 100 percent confirmed is that every single map in the game is going to be filled with christmas decorations of course in the halloween update all the maps had a bunch of halloween decorations decorations everywhere but in a recent JD video I believe Joven confirmed that he is going to be putting Christmas decorations all throughout the map seeing how he did the same thing for Halloween I think we're allowed to tell them a little bit something special that you're maybe doing this year yeah I'm building a whole new map I'm just checking I'm just gonna be decorating maps again. The Halloween decorations is one of my favorite parts of the Halloween update this year, so it's gonna be really exciting to see all the Christmas decorations in all of the maps, but something else we all know is gonna be coming into the game is a brand new Christmas box and a Christmas battle pass. It's almost a given we're gonna be seeing a brand new box and battle pass. It'd be stupid for them not to do that, which means that we're also going to be seeing a brand new Christmas chroma and a brand new Christmas ancient as well. Of course, the chroma is gonna be extremely hard to unbox and the ancient is gonna be extremely expensive to buy, so good luck for anyone trying to get the brand new Christmas items since they're gonna be tough especially for some new players Oh, but something else we are gonna be seeing this one's really exciting But we're gonna be seeing a Christmas gifting system in the game This is something we do not see in Halloween But in the Christmas update something we've been seeing every single year since 2019 You're able to spend around a thousand snow tokens on a present in murder mystery 2 And you're able to gift to have a murder mystery 2 player of your choice and they get a random mm2 item out of that gift Since of course Christmas is the season of giving it's a very nice addition to be able to give some free items to your MM2 friends. And if your friends are lucky, they might even get a godly or even a chroma from the gift. And that is possible, believe it or not. But that's gonna be pretty cool. But something else we are gonna be seeing is a brand new Christmas leaderboard. Actually, two Christmas leaderboards. Christmas always has two leaderboards instead of one. One for just collecting all the snow tokens and one for giving out gifts. Of course, for the most gifts given and the most snow tokens collected. Of course, the snow token leaderboard is gonna be completely free to play for any players that don't got a whole lot of Robux to spend. But if you do have a lot of Robux to spend, you're able to use that Robux on the gift gifting leaderboard to try to get a trophy item that way. But it's always super expensive going for that. So only go for that if you have like hundreds of thousands of Robux in your account, which most of you guys are not gonna have. Only like a few people are gonna have that. If you are wondering if we're gonna be seeing a split currency for Christmas, it has been confirmed that we're gonna be seeing nothing but snow tokens in the map, as confirmed by Nicholas himself. At least I believe he said that, but it has been confirmed one way or another that we are not gonna be seeing any coins in the Christmas update, which is gonna be extremely exciting since a lot of people's least favorite part about the Halloween update was the fact that we got a split currency but we will not have to worry about that this year now the next things I want to talk about sort of dive into leak territory so if you guys do not want to see any MM2 leak you are free to back out the video now but for those who don't know a couple weeks ago a lot of Christmas items got leaked for this year which are most likely going to be coming in the brand new Christmas update including all of these items as you can see on screen all these items most likely going to be seen in the brand new Christmas box and in the brand new Christmas main Event. and maybe even some of these items could be for a potential brand new feature if the mm2 team decides to do something new for christmas which they do sometimes like to do some new features in christmas so we're looking at to see if they do something like that this year but we can definitely see all these items are going to be used for the christmas update at least most of them will be we're just gonna have to see if all these do end up coming out into the game but something we are expecting is a brand new evo seeing these leaks right here as you can see these four items all with a similar theme to them this gingerbread evo as you can see there's like a gingerbread rare gingerbread legendary a gingerbread god 
Dudley, and a gingerbread ancient site. If you guys are wondering, these are all made by Adam Ami Use. I'll show up some of these items in Adam Ami Use's inventory right now if I can end up finding them for the video. But you guys do not have to worry about these being like fake leaks or anything. Like these are real leaks, and we're always going to see if these will come into the game or not. But make sure to have some Robux saved up for a potential new Evo. So it seems like that's what we're going to be getting this year instead of a Christmas bundle. So and that's definitely going to be exciting. But what a lot of people are most excited about is this sniper that got leaked for the Christmas update. As you can see, there's a gingerbread sniper that is assumably going to be a set with the gingerbread Evo site. So we've never seen a sniper in Murder Mystery 2 before, so a lot of people are excited to get this into the game. This will probably be the ancient at the end of the battle path, so make sure to have some snow tokens saved up or maybe even some Robux. If you guys do want to spend some Robux on the snow tokens, like what I'm probably going to be doing. And that's going to be exciting. But the last leaks I do know about is this Christmas tree godly set. I don't actually think I showed these off in my Christmas leaks video, and these items did end up getting leaked after that video, but I believe these two gullies are a work in progress, so they might get some touch-ups when the update does eventually drop, but we do see that I don't have use has been working on a Christmas tree godly set, which is very exciting, especially seeing that we were supposed to get a Christmas tree godly last year, but it ended up getting cancelled, so this might be finally our time to shine to get a brand new Christmas tree godly, but yeah guys, that is everything we should be expecting in the Christmas update. Please sure let me know if you guys are hyped for this Christmas update, and what are you most excited for in this update? I'm probably the most excited for the brand new Evo that we're going to be seeing as well as the brand new Christmas sniper just because we've never seen a sniper in MM2 before. Yeah guys, the Christmas update is coming in a couple weeks so make sure to stay tuned for that. But yeah guys, that's how I did this video so I'm going to end it off here. So until next time, goodbye!